The Monk School of Global Affairs and Public Policy also referred to as the Monk School at the University of Toronto is an interdisciplinary academic centre with various research and educational programmes committed to the field of globalisation. It offers master's degrees in global affairs, public policy, European, Russian, and Asia-Pacific studies. The school also offers a certificate program in global journalism. History It occupies the historic Devonshire House, a former residential hall of the university's Trinity College, and in 2012 opened a second location at 315 Bloor Street, West Observatory Site after an $80 million collective contribution from the Peter and Melanie Monk Foundation, the Government of Canada, and the Government of Ontario. The school is located in the north and south wings of Devonshire House Building on Devonshire Place, which is shared with Trinity College's John W. Graham Library. In 2012 the school opened its second location at the observatory site at 315 Bloor Street, West formerly Admissions and Awards which houses the offices of the Citizen Lab and the Master of Global Affairs program. It was founded as the Monk Center for International Studies in 2000, named after Canadian businessman and philanthropist Peter Monk who made a $6.4 million donation to finance the construction. The current interim director is Randall Hansen, who is also the director of the school's Center for European, Russian and Eurasian Studies. On April 6, 2018, the University of Toronto announced that the Monk School of Global Affairs would merge with the School of Public Policy and Governance to become the Monk School of Global Affairs and Public Policy. The merger took effect on July 1, 2018. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Academics. Topic. Master of Global Affairs The Monk School's Master of Global Affairs MGA program is a two-year interdisciplinary professional degree aimed at equipping students with an awareness of global and financial systems, global civil society, and global strategic and security issues. Students are also encouraged to think critically and responsibly on global issues, and are provided with leadership training and management skill building. The program requires students to complete a relevant internship with an NGO, an international organization such as the UN or WTO, or at an embassy or consulate abroad. After a general first year of study, students specialize in one of three streams, Global Economy and Markets Global Civil Society Global Institutions Umga students can also complete their degrees concurrently with an MBA at the Rotman School of Management or with a JD at the University of Toronto Faculty of Law. The Monk School and the Paris Institute of Political Studies Sciences Po also offer a dual degree program between their respective MGA and Master in Public Policy MPP degrees. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Master of Public Policy The Monk School's Master of Public Policy MPP program is a two-year professional degree, with a core curriculum emphasizing practical and applied dimensions of policymaking. Core courses include micro- and macroeconomics, legal analysis, political science and quantitative methods for policy analysis. The curriculum also includes five electives, that allow students to bridge the spheres of domestic policy, law, and international policy. Invited visiting public sector leaders and external researchers bridge theory and practice, providing contact with senior professionals in government and the broader public, private and community sectors. 
Second year MPP students can compete for exchanges with partner institutions in Europe and Asia. Partner institutions include The Hertie School of Governance Berlin Sciences Po's Paris School of International Affairs Paris The Lee Kuan Yew School of Public Policy Singapore National Graduate Institute for Public Policy Japan In addition to the two-year coursework students are required to complete an internship during the summer between the first and second year. The school internship partners include the Canadian Federal Public Service, the Ontario Public Service, the City of Toronto, the City of Mississauga, as well as many non-governmental organizations and research think tanks. <laughs> <laughs> Joint and collaborative degrees Collaborative Master's, PhD program in South Asian Studies Collaborative Master's program in Asia-Pacific Studies Ethnic and Pluralism Studies Collaborative Graduate Program Fellowship in Global Journalism The Dynamics of Global Change Collaborative Doctoral Program Topic. Trudeau Center for Peace, Conflict and Justice Established as a degree program in 1985 and as a center in 2001, this multidisciplinary undergraduate program attracts some of the top achieving students who go on to take positions in prominent international organizations such as the United Nations, work on social justice issues through non-governmental organizations, and pursue graduate degrees in law and social science. The Trudeau Center for Peace, Conflict and Justice administers the Peace, Conflict and Justice Program PCJ in the Monk School of Global Affairs. It grew out of the Peace and Conflict Studies Program established by Anatole Rappaport in the early 1980s. In 1990, Thomas Homer Dixon assumed the directorship and continued in that role through 2001 when the program was institutionalized as the Trudeau Center. Homer Dixon's directorship ended in 2007. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Undergraduate programs. American Studies Contemporary Asian Studies European Studies Hungarian Studies International Relations Monk One Program Peace, Conflict and Justice Public Policy South Asian Studies Topic. Research Centers Asian Institute Canada Center for Global Security Studies Center for European, Russian, and Eurasian Studies Center for South Asian Studies Center for the Study of Korea Center for the Study of the United States Center for the Study of France and the Francophone World Dr. David Chu Program in Asia-Pacific Studies The Bill Graham Center for Contemporary International History Trudeau Center for Peace, Conflict and Justice Topic. Criticism The school has been criticized by students and faculty for accepting $35 million from Peter Monk and the terms of agreement between the school and Peter Monk. Paul Hamill and John Vallow, faculty members at University of Toronto, stated that that agreement will allow Monk family to determine the university's priorities in place of the faculty and students, reduce the academic independence, and allow the Monk family to shape the academic work. Topic. 
Research and public education R.F. Hani Programme in Ethnic, Immigration, and Pluralism Studies The Andrea and Charles Bronfman Chair in Israeli Studies The Global Ideas Institute The Global Justice Lab <laughs>